Hi Scorpio, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Scorpio, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Scorpio. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Judgment card. So this is your energy, Scorpio. You could be dealing with another Scorpio with this energy as well. So this is an energy of you facing yourself, getting some sort of clarity, some answers is what I'm seeing here. This could be even an epiphany, an awakening happening here. I also do see with this card, this is um, a card of someone wanting a, a second chance is what I'm seeing. And um, you being put in a position where you have to choose or make some sort of um, make something clear to someone is what I'm seeing with this judgment card and I am seeing here that um, you are in that position where you have to decide and give some answers so you're making some sort of judgment call here with this card um, okay so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about this Scorpio okay so the first card we have here is the eight of pentacles so this is earth energy Virgo Taurus Capricorn energy Next, we have the Six of Wands, Fire Energy, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo Energy. And finally, we have the Ten of Pentacles, Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. Okay, so I am seeing here that someone really wants to work on a relationship. So this could be pertaining to a long-term relationship um, that is already... Um, a connection that you've been in for a long time a very long-term connection or this could be the potential for that with that ten of pentacles someone here wants this with you they want this um this is abundance this is material spiritual emotional abundance fulfillment as well as what i'm seeing here so someone sees you as someone who they can build this with have a legacy with be a power couple with and i do see that this person they really want to work on the connection with this eight of pentacles this is them wanting to really commit and give it their all this person is ready to um put in the hard effort and work that it takes to make a relationship last a very long time and um they also want something that's um either you or this person could be in the public eye is what i'm seeing with the six of wands they don't want something that's secret or private there is a sense of this person they are the type to like to show off their partner. Um, there is also something about you and this person being a very uh, good looking couple. Um, you may get a lot of attention together. Um, you know, there could be just all eyes on this couple is what I'm seeing. But with that judgment card, I do see that um, this could be someone who you've dealt with before and they are coming through as wanting a second chance with you. Um, because uh, I do see you being in a position where you have to make some sort of judgment call here. But this connection does have that potential to go the long term. I do see this person as showing up as very serious. This time with very pure intentions. They genuinely want to work on this. So I do see that they want... Um, there's they, they want some sort of like power couple i do see you guys could be very good looking couple who works well together and um you know people may even see you guys as like couple goals is what i'm seeing here um there is a lot of potential for um higher status that results from this connection um there there is you know some sort of achievement around this connection is what i'm seeing and this person is really ready to put in the effort to make that happen Okay, so let's clarify these cards, um, Scorpio. Okay. 
Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Four of Swords in the reverse. So this is Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. And this is an energy of coming out of healing. Um, this is an energy of getting back out there, uh, having recovered and really feeling quite rejuvenated, having taken some time off and then coming out of that, um, that break. So I do see that there may have been a break between you guys. And this person is now returning, resurfacing into your life. With that judgment card, I also see that this is a connection that's very transformative. I do see it changing you, um, both of you, for the better. So you could even find that as a result of this um, connection, you may be gaining some sort of um, uh, knowledge with that Eight of Pentacles, but also status with that Six of Wands and um, even finances could be increasing. There is something about the connection just changing you for the better um, on the material realm is what I'm seeing. And this doesn't, it doesn't have to be that you are gaining this from this person. It's possible that you guys could be accumulating a lot um, as a couple together. So this, there's that power couple energy about this union. And I do see that there may have been a break at some point between you guys. And I do see this, this a lot of transformative energy. So this, this can even be spiritual healing, um, changing a lot and seeing things differently and coming out of that um, break. I see um, there is an ending to some sort of break between you guys. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say about the Scorpio. Okay, so next we have the Judgment card again. Okay, so you could be dealing with another Scorpio. Then we have the Lovers card, Gemini Energy. You could be dealing with a Gemini. And finally, we have the Knights of Swords, Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. Okay, so I do see that this is a very um, fated connection with that Lovers card. Um, there is a sense of you guys having a tie to each other. This is a very uh, divine connection. It's very your souls recognize each other it's very deep and sincere i see a lot of intensity around the connection and i do again see that second chances energy with that judgment card as well as that knight of swords because the knight of swords is an energy of a person who is trying to win back their lover so i do see that there may have been some sort of break for whatever reason you guys were apart for a while but i see this person coming back with an energy of them wanting to um have a second chance at this connection because this is a connection that has a lot of potential um i am seeing a power couple energy here and you guys it's almost like you guys are very compatible um you guys on a soul level as well as well as on the material realm you guys work well together and there is a sense of you guys being able to accomplish a lot to, um as a couple and i do see with that um judgment card showing up twice there is just a lot of transforming that's happening here as a result of this um, relationship. So I do see you're facing yourself. Both of you are facing yourselves. And um, I actually do see you guys coming back together with this lover's card. Th this is a very difficult um, connection to get away from. It's, it's almost like it's fated. It's meant to be. Um, it's universally ordained. And I do see that... Um, there, there is some decisions that are needing to be made right now with this judgment card and that lover's card. I see um, an ending to a break or a, a separation period. And um, I do see you guys may decide to work on this because the Eight of Pentacles is also an energy of working on things. Um, putting your all, committing to something and dedicating your time and energy and effort to this. So I do see you guys um, coming together and working on this. And I also do see a lot of eyes on you guys. You guys get a lot of attention as a couple. You may be a very beautiful couple and I do see couple goals around this. Okay, so um, this person really wants to have their say here. They're, they're coming through very hasty with this knight of swords they really want to get this going and this person really believes in the connection and they do want this ten of pentacles with you okay so scorpio i am going to pull out an oracle card for you So the card says, communication is key, new moon in Gemini. OK, 
okay so i do see uh some sort of someone here is rushing in to have some sort of talk with you communicate with you about something you haven't been um in contact for a while i'm seeing but someone is rushing in to change that and i do see with this knight of swords energy they have something they want to express to you communicate to you and um i do also see decisions needing to be made about the relationship this is also an energy of being at a crossroads i do see this is going to be very blunt open honest even raw communication here um, I do see a lot has taken place during the time apart with this judgment card. I see a lot of healing and facing of oneself and transformation as well. But I do see um, this is a connection that can really be saved by communication. Because I do see it's a connection that actually has a lot of potential. So that's what I'm seeing here. Communication is key. So that's what I'm seeing for you, Scorpio. I hope you have a really, really good day, Scorpio. Bye, Scorpio.